We drink and use water every day in our lives. But do you know where your water actually comes from? So most water comes from either surface water or groundwater. If you live in a city, your water is probably comes from a surface water systems and then being treated before it goes to your tap. If you live in a rural area, then groundwater is most commonly used. But the real question is, what's in your water? So at Binghamton University, my research team and I, we study a group of compounds called PFAS, which is known as per and polyfluoroalkyl substance. So we actually use them in our everyday life. For example, in our batteries and in our water repellent jackets, firefighting foams, or in our kitchen, the non-stick cookingware. So PFAS are often known as forever chemicals. That's because if they've been released to the environment, they're not easily breaking down. And because of that, this raised growing concerns about their potential impact to our human health and also to the environment. So what we do at Binghamton University, we collect water samples from weavers and the Finger Lakes, and we took them to the lab to analyze the PFAS to better understand how those chemicals distribute in our water systems and how they accumulate. Clean water is a very precious resource. Protecting it is not just about science, it's also about safeguarding our future.